I fixed you some Jello. You know that doesn't have any calories. It's the uh, sugar-free, so that will give you a little bit of something sweet to eat. Living with my grandma is challenging because she's constantly watching what I put on my food and what kind of food I'm eating. I'm eating mostly lean meats and vegetables. But my grandma knows a lot about weight loss. She's even been helping me with my exercises. How do you think the diet's been going? I think it's going good. I so mean, you feel tough. pretty satisfied? Yeah, I feel like I'm doing, I'm doing a good job. Yeah, I think you are. I think my grandma thinks I can lose the weight, but she's worried that maybe I'm not gonna try as hard as I should because it, there's a fear in the back of her mind. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm still nervous about seeing the doctor again. I wasn't able to make it to my last appointment, so I called and asked if I could have a little more time. He asked me what was going on, and I told him. And he's concerned about my lack of support if I moved to Houston. And he told me I could wait another month, but that I need to lose another 30 pounds to show him I am staying on track. So I should be down 60 pounds when I come back. And I'm not sure what to do right now. Because if my sister won't move with me, then the only other option is my mom. And I don't know if she can. See, you're getting better there. <laughs>